Hey, what's up, people? Welcome back to my channel. Now, today I'm showcasing this 2x2 bunker um, loot storage compact base, whatever you want to call it. Uh, obviously, there's loads of loot storage, it's got external peak downs, uh, bedrooms, it's got lockers, anything you could ever want, uh, and a heli store. Uh, plus, if you want to win this giveaway, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Now, for the winner for last week's giveaway, we will reveal that right now. So I'm going to pick a winner, choose from all comments, and the winner is Mitchell Hansen. Thanks for the comment bro. If you want to hit me up on Discord, the link will be in the description, and I'll sort you out. Right, let's get into the build. So, starting this off, we're going to make a standard 2x1 with an airlock, and we're going to make the door and the door's roof out of wood. Now we're going to place our TC right in the left hand corner there and seal that in with a wall. Now so I don't waste your time and so I don't waste my time, uh, I'm not going to show me placing every single box in this video but with the power of editing uh, this is how it goes. Now if you want to see basically where everything is, slow the video down, pause it, you know, you can do this how you like, this is how I like to do it. Now, once you have enough materials, you can go ahead and destroy the wood at the front. Now you want two stone foundations out there, and cover that in with walls. Now you want one roof on top, and you want one roof out of twig. Then you can go ahead and get rid of the roof, and place two walls above that. Now you can use a furnace to jump up here, but I like to use a ladder. Now we can go ahead and cover that all in and slap our door down on the front. Currently this is what your base should look like. Now coming around for the honeycomb, the honeycomb is completely standard apart from this one here, you'll see why in a second. Now for this one here, you want it a half wall, a triangle floor, and then you just cover it in like normal honeycomb. Now, coming up for the second floor of the base, we're going to cover the whole thing, apart from this one here, with walls. And then we can cover the top in with our roofs. Now for the doorways. Now hopefully by now, you have a ladder hatch, etc. So we can go ahead and place a shop front and a ladder hatch on our doorway here. Now we can also do the same where this twig is now that we have ladder hatch. And you want to place a wall just on the other side of that. Now, surprisingly, you can actually fit a couple boxes down here. I will show you that now. 
Now you can fit two boxes, two small boxes, a sleeping bag and a barbecue down there. It's quite good for a little bit of loop storage. Now obviously we should also have garage doors, so we'll go ahead and where we can place the garage doors. Get rid of the double door as well and do the same. Now this is where our three furnaces go. You want to cover that in with my nice little honeycomb technique. And place a floor there. And again, I'm not going to waste your time. So with the power of editing, you will see how all of the boxes, etc. are placed in here. So just like that. And here we go. So we've got everything you could ever need. Obviously, pause the video, slow it down if you want to see it better. But there's a lot of loot room, a lot of storage, and a lot of accessories. Now, this is currently what the base should look like. Now once you have the materials, you go ahead and upgrade everything to metal and obviously your core to high quality. Now coming up to do the top side of our base, we can do all of the inside out triangles, like so, cover all the doorways in. Uh, and all the windows. Now I'm not going to show you putting every single window bar in, but again with the power of editing, you will see it. So after you've built these inside bits here, the base should look like this. And then once you've done it all of that, it should look like this. We've got lockers, we've got beds, we've got a loot room. Now coming up to the top side of the base, we've got loads of low walls that we will be placing on top. Just to give us a bit of extra protection whilst we're up here. And also our heli storage. Anyway, that is it from me for this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you do, leave a comment. Tell me what you thought of it. Also tell me what you want to see next. Peace. Oh, also, just to show you how this bunker works, we'll place a triangle floor frame and a triangle roof. Upgrade that roof to whatever and your bunker is sealed. To get rid of it, just demolish the twig and it's gone.